your girl Robin Chanel, the artist here. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're an existing subscriber, thanks so much for stopping by. So, so I'm coming to you guys today with my what's in my hospital bag for my um, delivery. Whenever Piper or the doctors decide, I don't know who it's gonna be. Is it gonna be an induction or is it gonna be, um, is she just gonna come on her own? So we'll, we'll know for sure soon, but I did want to film this before I get caught up in all of that. Um, so first things first, I think I'm going to film, I think I'm going to do Piper's bag first. Um, her bag is this beautiful backpack here. It is the best thing ever. I actually got this as a gift from Coco Femme. She is my auntie in my head. She, I call her my aunt. She calls me her niece. And um, she was a guest at my baby shower. And she gifted me with this beautiful bag by Skip and Hop. I will put the link below. It is so beautiful. Like I love it so much. I can't wait to rock it. Like it's really nice. Okay, so um, first things first, in this little zipper part here, this little zipper part right here, I um, packed some pacifiers for her. I packed like a lot of them. Even though they're gonna give me some at, at the um, hospital, I kind of wanted to have my own. So I packed her some of her pacifiers along with the wipes, um, the baking soda wipes to clean them with. I packed some little mittens for her because you know when babies come out they like to scratch their face. So I packed these little mittens here. They're so cute. They're by a child of mine. And some of these things, if I find links to them, I will put them in the description box below. Okay? And she has like matching um, receiving blankets with these. Mittens. So I think I packed her four pairs of mittens. And these are more like the really, really small ones. They're really, really cute. I like them a lot. So I packed four of those. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then <clears throat> in the big part here. I packed her swaddle blanket. It's just a little swaddle blanket thing to keep her comfy while she sleeps. And I packed her a blanket. It's really cute. I don't know who it's by though. I'm sorry. I had it as a gift, but it's just a pink generic regular blanket. Um, and then I packed her a little toy. Some wipes. These wipes are divine. They are absolute, <laughs> they're my absolute favorite. I wish I could use them on myself. I mean, I could, but they're hers. They smell so good. Oh my God, they make you just wanna just cover your nose up in the baby's neck, like seriously. So I have two packs of wipes. And then I bought this, her little tutu, her picture outfit. I'm kind of torn, I think. I may not be though, but I packed this little tutu for her, for her pictures. And it has a, it has a, um, a little head bow to match the detail on the tutu. But I honestly think, I, and these are for hospital pictures, not professional pictures outside of the hospital pictures we have a total different outfit but for in hospital it's gonna be this um, I'm, I'm gonna make her a flower crown so I don't think I'll be using this at all so that's that and then I packed her this little cute Victoria Beckham onesie along with this onesie and headbands. I packed her a couple headbands because if you know me, you know I'm headband crazy. So I packed her these. And then 
things for her to, oh, and I packed her some more headbands. Yeah. I'm, I'm pretty obsessed with headbands for babies. And then I packed her this little cutie pie. <clears throat> and this, which matches those mittens. So these are all the ones that match the mittens and they're from Child of Mine. I think that's like Walmart. Okay. And then I packed her a couple of regular onesies. And some leggings. And then she also has some socks in here. Some diapers, even though they're going to give us some at the hospital. And the, the receiving blankets I was telling you about that matches her um, mid. So I think I know for sure Dia gifted us with that. So thank you so much, Dia, if you see this video. We really appreciate you. And then I got another muslin. Well, not, it's not another. The other one is a swaddle blanket. This one is a muslin swaddle blanket. So I bought one of those as well. And I think she's gonna go home and something something about her in here. I haven't really decided yet. Honestly, I'm just ready for her to get here, kinda. I don't, not really, but kinda. I kinda wanna stay pregnant forever, but I know it has to come to an end. Bittersweet for sure. Um, so yeah, that concludes what's in Piper's bag. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and this little bag, this backpack that I got as a gift for her, like you can, it's like stroller friendly, so it's ways that you could put it on your stroller, you can wear it like so many ways. It is the cutest, like the cutest bag. I really, really love this bag. So shout out to Coco, one of the best gifts, really did, it made my day because this bag is really, really nice and I really like it. And it smells good too. So yeah, that concludes what's in Piper's hospital bag. I love it so much. I can't wait till she get here, guys. Like, I mean, like I was telling um, her godmom and my husband and my mother-in-law, like, I'm excited for her arrival, but in the beginning of my pregnancy, I was so sick and I was so small. So I didn't really really enjoy it. And then most people wonder if I was even pregnant because I wasn't showing. So I'm just starting to show. I'm just starting to feel pregnant. <laughs> Although like feel pregnant in a good way because the beginning was sucky for me. So it's kind of like, I don't, I'm not, I don't want to share her. <laughs> like I just want to stay, just want my stomach to get big and for her to stay there. But I know she has to come out and I know I have to share her. Um, it's just a bittersweet because like I said, I'm just now starting to like look pregnant and enjoy pregnancy and waddle and things like that. So the fact that that's coming to an end for me, it really does suck, but I am ready to have a daughter. So it's just like, it's just bittersweet. Okay, so next is my bag. And you know, shout out to Crystal giving me this bag years ago. I love it so much. I've had it for a while now. First things first, house shoes. Um, my mom, when she came here to visit me, the last time she came here to visit me, she brought me house shoes for Christmas. So I'm gonna have these because she won't be there for my delivery. Um, and my mom has been at every delivery of mine but this delivery, she won't be there. She um, is alive, she's fine and well. She just won't be at my delivery. So I'll have a piece of her at my delivery. So, my Clarisonic on my skincare is in here. Yes, I plan to wash my face. I, honestly, I plan to do my makeup too. I just don't know how any of that's gonna go. I may or may not, but I would definitely, definitely be washing my face and ass, for sure. Okay, so these cool things are called packing cubes. Um, Alex put me on to these, they save space, and they're really, really good in like condensing things. So in here, <clears throat> I have my little 
bath sponge, my favorite toothpaste, toothbrush, shower gel, a wet one, Kleenex, shampoo, this little travel kit, shampoo and all that jazz, some feminine wipes. They came with the pads that I bought, so I just packed them, and makeup removers. So this is what I will, this is my toiletry bag. Oh, and a wall charger. And this is all of the stuff that's like personal care. Reggie has packed his own bag. I asked him if he want to film one of these and he told me no. So I was gonna be like, what's in Piper's daddy's bag? But he wants to be an Aquarius. So I'm just gonna let him be one. Next, I do not like the um, pads that, or the underwear that the hospital gives you. So I bought the extra heavy overnight, always with wings, I think. Yeah, they have wings on them. Um, and I got these from Walmart, okay? And then, like I said, because I do not like the underwear they give you, I bought some Depends. Which is really dope because a lot of people, like I watched a lot of hospital um, bag books, like labor and delivery, all that. And a lot of people was like, they wish they would have gotten the pins. So I'm happy that I got some the pins because I do not like those underwear that they give, you, they give you. And what I plan to do, I opened them because I need to try them on. I got an extra large and <clears throat> the size is a 44 to 64 on waist so that but what i plan to do with these is wear them and then put the pad in the depend in the in the depend panty line if that makes sense okay gel i got my edge control gel malone I, I, I have to have it this is nectarine blossom I also got some daily cleansing pads for my face, some lotion, oh my god, this lotion, and, and I don't like Bath and Body Works, I'm not a fan of Bath and Body Works, but I love their lotion, and this lotion is okay. and that concludes my toiletry bag. Next, my bag with my clothes in it. Yes, I have two bags. All right, okay. So I have a couple of um, nursing bras, and I really do like these because I I tried these on. Not only are they super super comfy, but I love the feel of them. I love how easy they are to unstrap when you need to breastfeed or nurse or whatever the case may be. And I got them in black, pink, and nude, and I ordered them off Amazon. Next, I got this, um, these nice, they're not disposable, they're reusable nursing pads, and it came in this little pouch. And all of this, most of the stuff I'm, I'm going to show you, I got off Amazon, and I'll put the links below, okay? Next, I got a nursing, like, tea. I had to try it on, I got a little beard stain on it, but it's fine. I got a little nursing, um t-shirt thingy and I also got that off Amazon this is a nursing bra as well I got from Target and I'll also put that link below and then this is just another little nice nursing tee that I got from Target as well and then I got my romper um, I got a t-shirt to wear just in case for like comfort. And then I got my little pink shorts to wear. And I got my nursing gowns. Um, not my nursing gowns, my hospital gowns. I don't like the hospital gowns at the hospital and I kinda wanna be stylish and pretty. So I bought my own. I got one to deliver in. And then I have one to wear. 
and they are so cute you guys like wait till you guys see the link they come in all different colors and designs and things like that they are super super cute if I can I will post a picture of me like wearing one so you guys can see how cute they are I'm gonna try to feed it in somewhere okay and then last but not least are these socks I also got these from Amazon and the cool thing about these is they have the little grooves in it for the floor so you won't slip and fall so I have those shout out to Nisha B her hospital bag um, video was really really um, inspiring for me and that's how I found all these items but I'll list it for my supporters and um, subscribers in my description box as well and that is it that concludes what's in my hospital bag I am so excited even though this journey is almost over, I really, really appreciate you guys for being here, for your support, for your encouraging words, for your gifts, for your love, for all of that amazing shit that you guys have shown me these nine months ha has really been great. I'm now 36 weeks. I feel amazing. I'm anxious. I'm not anxious. <laughs> and i just really really appreciate the love so thank you so much for watching if you're a new subscriber please subscribe um and i love you guys bye